Hello TVO, I'm Drew Hayden Taylor, novelist, playwright, and filmmaker, and welcome to my home here in downtown Curve Lake First Nation. Basically, I have just finished a novel. I finished one uh, about three days ago, so I've been concentrating on that the last two months, and I've been going back and forth between uh, the Reserve and Toronto, one of the drawbacks of living on a reserve is there's not a lot of Thai or Greek food. So uh, so I've been writing, um, doing, uh, doing recording sound on a documentary series I'm doing for APTN, um, and doing laundry, that's about it. I read a book on the Third Reich. I just read a play by um, Kevin Loring, who's the artistic director of the uh, Indigenous Theater at the National Arts Center. Um, so I've been, I've been, I read a mixture of Indigenous literature and pop culture and can lit. Spaghetti and meatballs from scratch. And then the following night, I'll probably make a beef and broccoli stir fry using tenderloin. So I've been having great fun doing, doing, finding the time to sort of, if you'll pardon the pun, sink my teeth into uh, some challenging recipes. I'm gonna to go to a restaurant, get some food that I can't make. I, I miss going to restaurants and go to a movie or a play. I had a play running at Magnus Theater in Thunder Bay. Um, uh, cottagers and Indians and it was running there and on its fourth or fifth performance uh, basically the hammer came down and the show was cancelled and I was lucky to get out of Thunder Bay. I am happiest right here as you can tell all around me I've got this beautiful room it's sort of half dining room half office where I sit here and I, I, I let my imagination fly. I hopefully create amazing things and, uh, and eat amazing things. I used to have a lot of dinner parties. Um, and so that's basically, I think, my, my secret talent. I, I, I like cooking. What we do in the shadows Sort of, it's a, it's, a, it's a half hour comedy about vampires in Staten Island. It's hilarious. I love uh, off the cuff, avant-garde uh, um, takes on, on basically genre fiction. I find an, an overtly tidy work environment is, is, it can be kind of annoying and a messy work environment can definitely be annoying. So I try and find that happy little middle ground. I'm not going out to restaurants. I'm not going out to plays, not going to movies or doing expensive uh, 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 trips and uh, things like that. My, the drinking has gone down. The money spent on alcohol from, at, at, uh, for wine and things like that at dinner time. Um, no, my costs have gone, have gone down, but then so is my income coming in. So I'm roughly about even. I'm hoping people understand that this is not going to be the only event. People are talking about, you know, there was SARS, uh, what was that, 20 years ago? Um, the, the Spanish flu in 1918 to 1919. So it's gonna happen again, and I just hope people realize that and put a little more money into researching this. Thanks, TVO, for coming by. The Agenda with Steve Pakin is brought to you by the Chartered Professional Accountants of Ontario. CPA Ontario is a regulator, an educator, a thought leader, and an advocate. We protect the public. We advance our profession. We guide our CPAs. We are CPA Ontario. And by viewers like you. Thank you.